pulls it out. Tavares back hand towards the goal. Loose puck. Everybody scores. Tie game. Can you believe it? The decision you've made to listen to this audiobook could be one of the best decisions you ever made to help improve your hockey career, to also help improve all aspects of your life. Pete Fry, the founder of Puckmasters Hockey Training Centers, who's produced over a dozen NHL players and many major junior and college players and has franchises across North America, has put together the key elements of a strong mental training program. Following these ideas, you can make it to the top. I'd like now to introduce the founder of Puckmasters, Pete Fry. NHL players. I always ask them the same question. How much of the game is mental? Their answer consistently is 80 to 90%. Now we know that you are working on the physical part of your game. We know that you are working on your hockey skills. Now is the opportunity for you to work on that 80 or 90%, the mental part of your game. Secret number one, think big and get big results. You have to think big to be big. Here, WHL scout Todd Ripplinger talk about a small player who used big thinking to overcome great obstacles and become a national hockey hero. Jordan Eberle played minor hockey in Regina. I uh, was always told he was too small. Jordan Eberle's Bantam draft Jerry was still told he was too small to play. It gets overlooked in the draft. Regina Pats uh, end up selecting him in the seventh round of the draft. Was still told he was too small to play. Just gets an invite for the World Junior uh, Championships. Team Canada. They go on to win the gold medal. Jordan Eberle scores with five seconds left in the game to tie the Russians in the semifinal. Pulls it out. Tavares backhand towards the goal. Loose puck. Everybody scores! 